Hello, in this video I am going to explain the steps to model a tunnel using the Ecosim profile tool. Uh, let me first of all explain the environment. I have uh, an alignment received from Open Roads, is defining the road alignment and, and the red lines, and the green line will be the tunnel alignment. You can see how the green line is crossing the terrain, right? You can see on the top and front view. And you can see how it's crossing the model, right? So let's follow the next step. The first step is we are going to create the tunnel profile in a WordSets library. Second, we will create a new catalog item. And finally, we will use the place profile tool to model the tunnel. Step by step, let's go to create the tunnel profile in a WordSets library. So this is Ecosim. I have created a new file on my project, standard cell, that's a new cell library. And in this cell library, I have a couple of models. One model is called a tunnel ring that is representing the profile. It's 2D model, right? There are models created with design 2D. And this tunnel ring is having a, a distance of nine meters nine and a half meters right and the other model is just a 2d model representing the the ring and the other uh, model is just including the platform and if you take a measure again from that point to that point you can see this is 9.5 meters right so we have the tunnel profile cell with two models ready to be used at tunnel profiles so let's go back to Ecosim, right? This is the worksheet I'm working, and I'm going to the catalog editor, right? With the catalog editor, I can create a new catalog uh, type. The new catalog type will be defined using the tool template, the place profile, right? We will use these properties, and we can include uh, even in sample the object. Uh, discipline right we can add more properties in sample the object discipline here so everything is the properties are defined here the new catalog type will be called tunnel by profile i will create on my word set i can select one of the files or create a new file on my word set right so i will select this one word set definition the discipline group in this case will be structural and a new subgroup I have created called a civil, right? So this is a new catalog type called a tunnel tunnel by profile on my word set, the structural discipline. I will add the catalog type to the structural filter and also the two template displays profile. So doing that, what I have is a new uh, a new catalog item, right? On the structural discipline civil subgroup called tunnel by profile. Now I can create a new catalog type, but sorry, a new catalog item, right? A new catalog item in the word set, also in word set catalogs, and I will call it uh, tunnel ring, right? This tunnel ring is having all the properties to be filled by default, and the minimum I need is the part definition, right? I can go to select my uh, structural concrete sample and select uh, in situ concrete walls this is the part um, family user the cell symbol name is looking for the cell libraries available on my configuration so the tunnel profiles i created before must be available here and i can select the tunnel ring also i can add some classification in the sample i can go to uh, Omni class and select a or an example app or make a query by tunnel or by concrete. If there is a, an example tunnel construction or vehicular tunnels, right? This is for side walls, for tunnel excavation, cement tunnel, in example, right? So cast in place concrete tunnel or this is for laning, this one. So you can see how I can add properties by default. And I will create a second one. Let me duplicate and let me call it tunnel ring uh, with platform. Right. And for this one, tunnel ring with platform, I will use a different 
profile tunnel ring with platform so what I have done until the moment is I have created the tunnel profiles in the WordPress library and I have created a new catalog type and items right for tunnels by profile so now I can save in closing the catalog editor So once the catalog editor has been closed and saved, I can go to my ecosystem menu, architectural ribbon bar, and select the profile tool. If I select the profile tool, I can see that there is the category profile with all the default um, profiles available with ecosystem for selling molding or chain rail or offset profile. But I have a new category called tunnel by profile. It's the category created because I create the catalog type tunnel by profile and the catalog I type tunnel by profile have two catalog items tunnel ring and tunnel ring with platform right you can see so I can go to place a tunnel ring with platform in this case by profile and I can place it by line selecting two points right you can see how it's created or I can directly select to create the bypath as I told before, the green line is the green alignment is for the tunnel, right? So I just need to select the green line and select a second point on the line defining the direction. So automatically, Ecosync will create a section or a tunnel divided by segment, and each segment will match in the vertex created with alignment. So you can see, depending on the vertex, including on the alignment, is creating different number of segments. You can see how the tunnel has created crossing the terrain. The tunnel can be seen here, crossing the terrain. And if I go to check my schedules in Ecosyn, I can see under the category Structural Civil Tunnel by Profile, I can find all the items. In this case, it's 44. The East Called tunnel with platform created by Ecosim, classified by only class, and the length, the area, or the value is calculated by the application. So you can navigate and you can see how each vertex was separated five meters, right? And even you can see that on the straight path there is a big, big uh, module, and this will be this one with 45 meters, right? So each segment is created based on the vertex created on the uh, open road alignment right this is the explanation about how to do a tunnel modeling in ecosim using the profile tool remember the step was create the tunnel profiles within the words library create a new catalog item and finally use the place profile tool you can do it by path to model the tunnel automatically along the alignment i hope this video was useful for you